Hello everyone and welcome back to Kronos Plays Bloodborne. So we switched up weapons again. I'm now using my saw spear. I added some gems to it so it's a little stronger than the axe, but I haven't actually used this weapon at all since I first got it. My voice apparently has decided to f say fuck it at the beginning of this episode, oh well. So we are at layer three <clears throat> and another branching path, all right. The last one led us to a chalice, right? That's a trap. Alright. <laughs> Hopefully this leads us to ingredients for said chalices. Um. Ah, that guy's new. Ow. He stepped on the thing. I guess it didn't go off. Alright. Hello. You know what I should have done? You're right, is uh, light up that lantern first. Let's heal up and cut him in half. All right. Have we seen you before? I don't think we've seen you before. We've seen the blue guys with the lanterns, but they have like... Guys, I think there's things behind that door. Ha! Oh, okay, I deserve that, you're right. We're just gonna keep doing this. Oh, I got him. Oh no, I didn't! Well, there's a chest over there. Some more blood vials. I think we just cleared out that room. I don't know why they aggroed so easily through that door. I think we tried using the, the saw spear, like, when we first got it, and I just didn't keep with it. Or I might have gotten the, the great sword just to be after it. Someone came... Maybe not. Alright. I hear, like, gunfire or something. Oh! Really? Oh, shit, alright. <laughs> Let's hurry up. Remind me that's there so I don't forget, please. What is that noise? It sounds like howling. Kind of reminds me of, uh... Twilight Princess. Well, shit. Alright. Hopefully I don't need any transient curses to deal with them, because I don't have any. Hey, Bagman, how's it going? Good? Great. Hello, you son of a bitch! Okay. We got it? Good. Well, tempering blood gemstone too. Alright. Go away, Ash. Thank you. I don't trust these, uh... Well, I don't trust those guys, either. I was gonna say the pots, because last time I was around them, they blew the fuck up. Fire paper. Lovely. Madman's knowledge. That's... Sure to come in handy at some point in the future, probably. Is that it? I guess that's it. Alright. 
Let's go back to where we f saw that ghost. Maybe the ghost we just killed was this one that disappeared? I don't know. It seemed like she possessed the, uh, the bag man. But that could have just been her teleporting onto me. Some thick, cold blood. There's a door. Actually, there's two doors. We'll go this one first. They probably loop around to each other. Or not. Man. Alright. Some two mold, some quick silver bullets. And let's our top ourselves off to full health. I guess the only area item. Nice. I missed this. I don't know how I missed that. Oh, there's two doors. What? Hey, guys. Open the door. Also, and that looks uncomfortable. Alright, so I guess we go back to Boulder City and then take the other path. I mean, I could jump down there. But I might miss something if I do that. Or I might gain something. You're not wrong. Good timing on the boulder. I could follow the boulder all the way down and... See if there's a door or if that hole leads to something. You know what? No. Not, not yet. Oh, did that... Eh, whatever. Let's go find the lantern. Yeah, so we go through here. We avoid the trap. We step on the trap. That's how we avoid it. You're right. There's the door. Okay, there's the lantern. Now, I'm going to go back to that boulder. One of these days. Bam, zoom, straight to the moon. Man, I'm not even old enough for that reference, alright? So, yeah, we're going to go back to Boulder City. We're going to wait for it to go down. Then we're going to run, like, right behind it. And maybe there's something down there. I... I don't like the odds of this. There is! Oh my god! I also want to see what's down that hole. Well, let's go down this way first. Hello. I see a bag man, I think. Uh, yeah, that is a bag man. Wow, this place is like... Pretty cool looking. All these look like traps. Hey. Oh, shit. Oh, what was I worried about? <sighs> Lantern scared me. Okay, there I saw one chest, two chest. We've yet to run into a Mimic. So... There might not actually be Mimics in this game. Which is surprising. Seeing if that was a trap. Oh, three chests, alright. I would totally just steal all of this. Sage wrists? I think we had one of those before. Yeah, uh... No. Oh, you know what? No, we saw it on the menu. And more two mold. Alright. 
Is that it for chests? Looks like it. Now for the other part of the Boulder City. We're gonna wait for it to pass, then we're gonna go look down that hole, see if there's anything there. No. No, there is not. In fact, it just disappears. Okay, now. Let's get the hell out of Dodge. I like this armor. I, it's not really better than the armor. Like, the armor in this game just doesn't seem to improve. It seems to be a compromise to a stat somewhere and a boost to this stat somewhere else. And that's fine, I guess, but... Yeah. It looks pretty neat. It reminds me of uh, Beatrice's armor from Dark Souls. Except more skeleton-y. And I also was kind of hoping that I would get pyromancy for equipping it, but that was not the case. So there's the boss room. There's the bag man. There's a door. There was a frame drop there for a second. Don't know why. Hello! Dodge! Alright, good job. Another chest. We're just getting chests left and right. I like it! Give me all the chests you can. Preferably new weapons, though. Or a couple of sage wrists. That's fine, too. Oh, is this the... Other side of that door we were just at? Yes, it was. Good to know. I don't expect us to need to go back there, though. Maybe it's just a shortcut if, if you took that path second. Like you went back after clearing this area. Hey, Bagman. Hello. Don't push me into the fire, please. Or pull me into the fire. Boom! Shaka laka! There's a ladder over there. Ritual Blood 3. I think we needed like nine of those. No? Alright. One of you has to have someone in it, no? Oh, wow. Okay, before we go up the ladder, let's see if there's any doors. There is. Or is that where I came from? No, I came from back here. That's the Boster. Right. Alright. Let's go up first. And then we'll come back and take this door. I saw someone. Hopefully it's not another ghost. Running attack definitely kills those guys easily, though. And we got another one of those Ordon dudes. Alright. They're not too bad. Excuse me? Oh, there's a bell lady. Let's go. Where are you, sweetie? There. You're there. Now you die. Alright, we'll explore that room after we get back. There's the lever. And there's an enemy. That was a good lucky dodge. <laughs> Clearly it was skill, I mean. Are you a gun one or a club one? You're a gun one. How are you not dead? There's an item over there. You barely see it through the mist.
quick silver bullets. All right. Let's head up. We'll uh, look around that room we were just in and see if there's anything we missed. Another door, maybe an item. Could be nothing. All right. Nothing it is. Now we... Yeah, we came from that way. There was no other door in this room. Yep, all right. So we could go fight the boss. We're not going to do that yet just yet. Let's go through this door over here, though. Would love a new weapon. Something I've never seen before. Or at least don't have. Alright. Had to make sure, man. You know. Sell those for some good souls later on. I've yet to actually use them. That's it, huh? Hmm. Alright. Let's go and fight the boss. Should I put any... I don't have any bone marrow ash on. I could put, like, bolt paper on and... Uh, I only got one bolt paper left. Wow. And actually, I think I got that from a bag, man. And well, every time we get to a third level, we always... Level... Layer. Excuse me. We always fight that flaming hound guy. So, fire paper would probably be useless. But I only have one bolt paper, so it's not like... It's, yeah, I might as well put it on. My luck, it's going to be someone new that's strong against bolt. Whatever. New's good. In worst case scenario, if I die, I just put on my greatsword and come back and kill the guy. Pretty big room. It's like an actual lead up to a boss. That does not look like the hound. The Marian descent. Descendant, not descent. Oh, good dodge. Good. Harry, you don't have that much health. Let's not get too cocky, though. Oh! You, uh, can split apart your shoulders, huh? Well, I can stick my hand in your stomach. How do you like me now? Probably not that well. Oh, hopefully we get shoulders. Oh, please drop shoulders. Lower through me any challenge. God damn it, how far does this rabbit hole go? <laughs> I'm gonna run out of altars. I guess I can remove the chalices though. Is that it? Third level it? It seemed like it. Alright. Let's go back and. Well, check out the shops. Alright. This shop never really has anything new after we beat someone. It's usually when we get a badge. So, I think that's gonna... be the trend for that. Sup, doll? How's it going? Do you have shoulders now? Fuck. Ah, yeah, well. Well, let's go see... Uh, can we use this one yet? Nope. Yeah, we only got three altars left. So we can go to this one. We can go to this one. Can't go to that one. And we need... 
A lot more arcane haze for this one. Putrid offering. I don't even know what that means. Oh well. Um, we'll move on to the next area after the one reborn. I think it was this one over here. Yeah, Advent Plaza, I think it was called. So we'll go back there and we'll explore the area. Oh yeah, there was that uh, Castle Kanehurst or... Yeah, I think that's how you pronounce it. I'll look into how to get to there, or at least where it's located, and maybe we'll go there next time. But that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. If you're not subscribed yet, why don't you go over to my video section, check out some of my other content, and see if it's to your liking. Either way, thank you for watching, and I hope you all have a great day.